Hey guys, this is Project Dave playing some Callisto Protocol. Uh, so I'm recording this about the same time as the previous episode, which had like outstanding commentary by my standards. So we'll see if we can do that here. I did just take a nap. So I might like randomly yawn, but I'm not actually tired. Uh, which is typically the issue with Callisto commentary. So. There you go. So, again, the save did not keep... This time there was no combat, so... Like, I had killed every enemy, so I'm not... I guess manual saves, uh... Only rarely do manual saves count. Over... The, generally speaking, it will just put you at the most recent autosave. The mystery of the saves continues. So, this fight goes slightly worse. But I wind up having, uh... Decent health at the end. We got this animation, but in a different location. So, there you go. Approximate animations. The July. Uh. Oh, so apparently this is this area right here is immediately below where the game started. But I don't remember walking past this part. Uh. Did something change visually, perhaps? Who knows? But wind up walking up the stairs back to my old cell. There's nothing up there, but you can walk into it and then convalesce about the the mysteries of the universe and so forth. Huzzah! <laughs> no uh, brilliant trains of thought today. Tragedy. There is this uh, this bridge across the. Gap that I'm about to backtrack and cross. Can't remember if that's also part of the tutorial walk or not. So this is Elias' cell. So that part makes sense. But I feel like after Elias' cell there was not this jump over, so... Maybe the terrain mildly changed in the interim. It's possible. Uh, oh, the other thing is we reunite with Captain Farrah shortly, and his bio says he's 6'1", 170, so I'm 6'1", 6'1 and a quarter, and like 175, and I'm nowhere near as bulky as uh, Mr. 6'1", 170 here, so I don't, I don't think that's an appropriate weight for a military dude. It's got to be 180, 185, approximately, unless you were going for like a Robert Patrick build or something. But uh, that's not what they're doing with her. <laughs> Doubt your uh, weight assessment game. Uh, it's crafting Europeans. Maybe Europeans, for Europeans, that weight is more normal than uh, Americans. I do not know. Possible. I realize it's just fudging over 5 to 10 pounds, but it doesn't matter if, uh, if it's your primary heavy in the game. In theory, so weight assessment was the the most profound topic I could come up with. Amazing, well done, self. So this guy I recognized, and I was like, "Oh, we're at the beginning." But there's no like bonus collectible for coming over here or anything. Uh, granted, it's only supposed to be like 40 minutes ago or something, so it's not like. An extended period of time, but I guess this was the first level, because at the end of this, there's like a big text that shows up. This is aftermath, so I guess every chapter has one of those little breaking points. There you go. But that's mostly it for me talking. Uh, this episode split up pretty neatly. I could just talk for half of it, and then the rest of it was mostly dialogue. Uh, once again, this this particular area is very pretty. So enjoy the fancy lighting and the famous actors in your video game. Uh, though I'm mostly familiar with uh, Karen Fukuhara. No, I got you. I got you. I'm sending in Squad Nine. Sir, Squad Nine is gone. Hold your position. Fall back! We've lost containment! 
All right, then activate all tactical units. You are weapons free. Repeat, you are weapons free. Yes, sir. But, sir, that will... Now that's in order. You kill anything that moves. Get in here. You think I got time for this shit? Okay. Okay, okay. Let me see if I got this straight. Uh, you crash here. And then this whole place goes to shit. Oh, five, two, one. Look at me when I'm talking to you. What'd you do? Huh? You can tell me. Are you different? Are you special? Why the warden? Why you arrive? I told you. This is my kingdom. It's all yours. <laughs> Alas, I'm through. And so was Ferris. What do you mean? He was there. Things kill them. <laughs> You're harder than I thought. Just keep going now. I found a safe room up ahead. to do what is required, to make the hard choices. As your new warden, I will do what is necessary for you, for this storied institution, for the good of all. 